Hey everybody, how you doing? <laughs> doing good. I've been playing with resin. So I'm on my third painting. I kind of realized from the first one that I um, did, was intimidated by the dryer. Okay. <clears throat> I mean the, the heat gun. So anyway, I have cobalt blue, metallic cobalt blue, acrylic in my resin in this one. And hopefully I did that correctly. Then, oh my gosh, it almost spilled. This stuff sticks. And I've spilt it twice. <laughs> this is that bronze nail. You paint your fingernail black and then you brush the powder on your nail. It's that holographic chrome they call it powder for your nails so this is powder chrome you can get it from Amazon you just look up uh, chrome powders but you can also buy that stone coat metallic and I'll bet that's even prettier chrome uh, bronze I mean <clears throat> I meant to say bronze well those are the chrome fingernail thing this is black the metallic black and this is the metallic white stone coat sorry if I'm not real clear here I'm a little nervous again okay so let me show you what I'm using first and then we'll get started You touch gets sticky. This is impossible to change the gloves every single time. So okay, so here is the stone uh, stone coat. That's what it looks like. You can go on their website. I'll have a link in the description. Great stuff. Love it. <laughs> totally loving this. And then I'm using the metallic cobalt blue. And then the stone coat metallic, the black, and the stone coat white metallic, which is like very frosty and um, cloudy, like transparent white. That's the way I'm looking at it. So here we go. I'm using a 14 by 14, and I really hope I have enough. Because I'm thinking three, six, nine. Okay, so I should just exactly have about seven or eight. And you need about, oh, seven. Yeah, for uh, 14 by 14. Eight, I think, I hope. I remembered it that. So here we go. <clears throat> the last time. I was intimidated by that heat gun a little bit and I did not apply the heat gun enough oh, and then I think I did a little too much in some spots it got too hot in some spots so it's tricky. And my second one turned out much better because I was able to blend them and make them look like clouds. You know what I'm saying? Like cloudy, mixed together, blended together. Okay, now I'll do the black. Get myself. 
sides with that. That kind of covers. I realize that if you use white around your edges, don't cover your edges too good. So, okay, here goes. We're going to use too much of the cobalt again. Man, forgot. Well, I did that the last one and it turned out a little too much cobalt. That's what I'm doing again. Oh well. I'll go over them. This chrome fingernail stuff, beautiful. Jesus, beautiful, those colors together. I'm going to do an acrylic painting with these colors. Well, I think I did last week. <laughs> uh, maybe I didn't use bronze, though, I mean. Gosh, I keep saying the wrong words. Wish I had somebody that knows how to do this real well with me. Because, yeah. <laughs> Be so nice to have somebody talk me through them. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. But I did realize, yeah, I was intimidated a little bit with the, the gun. The heat gun. Okay, I think we're good there. You guys, if my camera goes out, I'm really sorry. Popping lots of bubbles. I don't want to overheat it this time. But I do want it to get nice and cloudy. Like the last time. Blending, you know. Let's see. a whole lot either. I really learned that. I'm treating it like a pour painting and in a way. Oopsie. 
I'm gonna just tilt it back in the middle. And then I'm gonna heat gun it again. Okay. Whew, this is pretty. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, here goes. Oh yeah, I'm not laying it down, I forgot. Okay. Hope it's not getting too hot. go. That's pretty. That's beautiful. Oh my gosh. Has a little bit of those ridges things. I'm still not sure about that yet, but I'll find out. Maybe they go away once they dry. Look, I'm actually getting some cells out of this one. No way! <laughs> well, I'm leaving it alone. I like it. I think it's pretty and it's clouded. Isn't that pretty? Is it good? Just can't heat it up with that heat gun too much because it, uh, Will definitely starts to cure the acrylic or the resin faster. So I've heard. So I like this the way it is, like this. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's a success on this one. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm learning. I didn't have to use the hair dryer. Oh, I gotta hold it up just for you. You won't be able to see it too well because it's so sparkly, you guys. It's so metallic and gorgeous and shiny. It's hard to see it up close. So, I don't know if it does any good, but look at all those cells I did get. Okay, so I'm going to torch it once. Just to play it safe. There you go, touching everything's getting sticky. But I think all my, my bubbles popped. This is the one that I just wanted. I'll show you the other one real quick before the light turns off. That I was not totally happy with because it came out too, um, hold up, okay? I'll pause it just for a minute. I'm so excited because this is just gorgeous with the resin. But here it is, okay? And... It just had too much cobalt, but it's still beautiful. Do you guys see it? This one turned out really good. 
Didn't have big problems with chunky things either or anything. It just was not enough of the white in the... I wanted more. If it would have had more over here, I would have stopped. I would not have done another one. And the bottom right hand corner, I wanted more. But it's still gorgeous. Okay. But this one is exactly what I was looking for. <laughs> A mixture of them. Whoops. But yeah, they're just as shiny and just beautiful. I wonder if you can see the metallic shine. This is so pretty. So different doing these than regular. This is just beautiful right here against the light. I sure wish you guys could just see it in person. Man. Well, I think I'm learning, guys. Absolutely, I'm learning. I uh, need to just find out. Now, this is cells. I don't know doubt about that. Just a little bit of riveting, but not much here. Maybe that go, and that's from the metallic. Maybe that'll go away too once it's drying. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh. It's just so pretty. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I think I need to stop now. I used about. Let's see, it's a brand new bottle. I, I'm down to here. About a fourth. Well, a little over a fourth. About a third bottle. A third of the bottle. <laughs> it's addicting. So I dig this one so much. I love that bronze in there. Wow. Thank you, Mix Media Girl. <laughs> You're so right about... Now I know why she's always so excited about it. Now I know. I know the feeling now. But I'll tell you what. Everything you touch is sticky. My brand new heat gun. No wonder yours locked up. It's going to lock up too. Need to clean it. I wonder how you have to get them unstuck if it ever does stick. But all right, that's it. I'm digging this one, and I do like it this way. I think, yeah, so pretty. <laughs> okay, have a good one, guys. Take care now. Bye bye.